okay today we are going to focus two important things one is ligature and one is open type layout table and this one in font creator is called open type designer so let's go first and check what is ligature all right so when we go in a font creator and we have some ligatures right so this la with madda is isolated form and this la with madda is final form and is same la isolated and final form without madda right so these are called ligatures so when we are going to glyph properties we have to make sure that those are set as a ligature and apply and okay all right so these are considered as a ligature so what ligature is basically this is a pre-designed glyph that we combine with two of them so let me explain you in a different way right here right so let me clear this one okay and grab my pencil so if you remember in the school times there's an input and output right so we have designed this one this is lam initial right so when we write la lam alif la so this is lam alif and this is lam final and this is alif final so our input will be lam this one and alif final this one so how is gonna work so for example we write lam and alif final will be like that okay so technically this one supposed to show like that right but that's wrong we need the result like that all right so this is la so what we do here we will put input this one plus this one and equals this one right so just remember that input and output so we will set this one in a open type designer table and I will show you how we can make it so the ligatures are pre designed glyphs so we combine two glyphs and bring the results like that okay so for instance let me go back and I show you the one more example of Allah right so this is the actual way to write Allah so when you write without having a glyph so this is gonna be lam initial then lam medial this one this this one so one input second input third input and result will be this one basically this is like a if condition so if this one if this one and then should this one right okay so this is a ligature okay so I did not put one more ligature right here in my font this is right here right here Allah 
ओके सो दिस वन हैज देयर ओन यूनिकोड इज एफ डी एफ डी ओके सो वी कैन एड दिस लिगेचर राइट नाउ bearings you can set up from here too ad and ad all right and this is on a baseline perfect so we have a ligature and we have to give a input code or the code point is fd fd all right the arabic ligature oh no this is not the one this is fd f2 okay this is fd f2 so the arabic ligature allah isolated all right you can give a name okay and make sure this is a ligature all right so this is how you can create your ligature or you know what the ligature is now okay so now i will go in the next step is a open type designer in a font creator so before open type designer we used to have a another software that was microsoft vault I don't know how to use that but I just brought it just to let you know for your information if you don't have access for Microsoft um, uh, if you don't have access of font creator so you can draw or design your font in a font forge that's free and the Microsoft Vault is also free so you can download and use this one this one has similar features maybe same features but i will try to figure this out and make another video on a microsoft vault if you can go to microsoft website microsoft vault right here is developing open type fonts for arabic script so this is the information right here so you can go through all of those so you will see all those things right here and these are the compositions and everything that was all that that are already pre-built inside the font creator so if you don't have access to the font creator so you go download this microsoft vault and read this script i can leave the link in the description below so you can directly access and you can download this software and use microsoft vault all right so let's go back to our font creator open type designer okay so before i go to open type designer i will give you another information about input and output right so for instance in my previous video if you go back and check in the video number 1 or the part 1 i was talking about we need only those characters used in our font if you remember that so these code points are the unique code for the specific character is called unicode is assigned for each language in here and this presentation form a and b has 
similar characters also right and this one also presentation form B has similar characters right so what we did here we combine those characters right here in our font right you see that so basically these code points are the input points so we are what we're gonna do let me explain you right here so we input faf isolated form right and we are getting the result initial fa so every time we give the input for fa isolated form and getting the result of fa initial and we are again we are making those two i'm making it to table right now so you will see how i am doing it so we will do this three times input isolated form and getting the result of final fa again we will design this one isolated form and we will get the result of medial fa sorry medial fa right that's something So basically we are using these inputs to get this result in our open type feature. So this way you can click on this icon so go to the open type designer or you can go to font and go to open type designer right I have designed this one and I'll show you how I did it right so okay let's go to right here where i have another font that i have not put the tables so let's let me explain you how you can design tables go to font go to open type designer and you see this is empty there's three things right here script features and lookups and in the bottom you can import scripts inside the font or you can export those features for future or code editor this is the code editor i am not a code person so i don't know so all right and this is a current wizard okay so you can check your script how it is working so let's jump right here so a script so we are basically talking about Arabic script at this time. So you can add multiple scripts in one font. So in my future videos, I will go with multiple scripts, how it will work, how it will work. But right now we are talking about only Arabic script fonts. Even inside the Arabic scripts, you have multiple languages, right? So just put add new. You can right click on this one or you can highlight this one and click on the plus sign and you can click right here so you have three options default script comes with a default language or you have a custom language but we are going through a non script right so the non script is we have arabic right okay so we will select Arabic from here and this is Arabic and next and this one will be the default language Arabic okay so this came Arabic and this is default and after that we will add some more features in here when you right click on a default you have to add new item okay when you click new item you will select from the known features we're talking i will talking about this one later on these are the most important part that you have to understand so we want to add the feature so you see here this is scripts features and lookups lookups goes in the feature and features goes in the script right here 
so these are connected so you have to make the lookups first and then features first and then scripts so lookups goes in features and features goes in the script and then your font is working All right so let's go to create a lookup first so easier way so this is the first one so create a lookup so you have two options this is for positioning and this is for glyph substitutions all right so at this time we are going to add a single substitution right add this one now we have a single substitution when i click on single substitution there's another window pop-ups on the right right so these are the tables or clear tables or whatever and these are the scripts and you can this is a class manager this is very important part and i will explain you in a moment okay so you s notice that we have right to left right here so our language arabic script we write from right to left or this is called rtl so we click on that one so this will go from here right to left okay and even you can organize those and rename this one and call it single substitution initials okay or you can write it initial forms okay so single substitution initial forms okay so I'm gonna make it only one or two I show you okay so new and then you can go again and select single substitution and you can change the name right here and you will say single substitution medial forms okay medial forms and don't forget right to left checkbox right here okay and then you can go again and click single substitution and finish and rename this one as a terminal forms okay so this is terminal forms so lookups goes in the features and features goes in the script so first we need to add some characters or the glyphs in here okay so this is initial forms okay so what you can do click on the plus sign select initials okay so this is again input and output what we are input and what we are getting from output so you select input for instance keep in mind we are in initial forms so I told you earlier that some characters has only final forms and some characters has initial medial and final so we are using only those characters has initial forms like ba alif has only final form just keep in mind okay so we will select from here ba initial form so this is the input and we want this one is output okay go ahead and press ok now you see we are giving an input of a isolated form and we want the result of a me initial form so basically I'll go back again and explain you one more time that this one what I was talking about so we are only using those characters right this is bar right here right oh right this is bar right so we are using this unicode or the code point for our table right here so this one we will repeat for three times okay for initial medial and final okay so when you go again you can select another isolated form right here and you can go and select a me initial form right this is initials so you can add all initials right here this is the most easiest way to understand at the beginning level and I will go further and let you know the most efficient way to do this one too all right so this way you can add all those this is saw and you can add a saw initial 
so basically you are giving an input of sa and getting the result of this sa in the initial form so you can do it as same as as a medial forms right so when you select bar right here the same bar isolated form and select the bar medial right here okay make sure you are in a medial forms lookups so select bar isolated and get the result of bar medial okay you see that bar isolated and bar medial same for the next character too okay ta isolated ta medial and then sa isolated and sa medial okay and same for the terminal forms that's called final forms okay ba final okay so click okay so this is something wrong went here so basically this one goes right to left not left to right so make sure check on this one okay always check on right to left with arabic scripts so we are giving an input of ba and getting the result of ba final same thing again ta isolated and ta final okay and then go ahead and sa isolated and sa final all right so these are the lookups we are using at this time okay initial medial and terminal forms i just put three three characters to just understand okay so these are the lookups and now lookups goes in features when you right click on a feature and add new right and go to known features and over here we will add the same thing like initial forms medial forms and terminal forms so go to known features and go to initial forms right here select on that one and press okay right you see the feature shows up now initial forms and when you click new again on the features and go to the known features and go to medial forms this one you see medial forms press next okay and then select again right click new item go to the known features and type terminal forms okay terminal this one it says fina okay f i n a terminal forms click next so these are not used you see over here it says not used so we have to bring those lookups inside the features now you can right click add new initial forms now you see existing lookups so we have made the lookups already we have set it up already so you see over here this is initial forms and finish now when you click the plus sign you see those features right here these lookups inside the features okay so we can add multiple features but right now we are using only one single substitution feature at this time so add medial also click right click medial forms and select medial forms okay so when you collapse this one and you see these medial forms okay and right click add new existing lookup and we will go to terminal forms and click right here and we have those terminal forms right here so what i said earlier the lookups goes in features and features goes to scripts right so we did the lookups inside the features now we add these features inside the scripts okay 
now right click on a default go to the new item and existing features right now it's showing features so we will add those features inside the arabic script okay initial forms click on that one right now it came right here again go to new right click on default and go to new existing now we have remaining two only select on medial press next we have now this medial right and again go to default add new and existing features and select terminal forms right so we create lookups we add the lookups in the features and we add the features in our script right so you can add multiple languages meanwhile i am here i show you so this is arabic right so you can add new item and you can add arabic language or any other language for instance this is urdu right so you can add urdu features also in your in your language so you can add those if you have created the lookups or features you can add the urdu features in your language so this will be a multiple arabic script like font so we will talk this one about later but i was here so that i showed you okay so remove this one so these are the features so i have created ba ta and sa okay so this is the basic of creating a open type designer table of arabic script so again that i saw earlier so we repeat this character ba three times or we have to repeat it for multiple times for every single character ba ta sa and so on and so on so we are using this isolated form as input and get the result as this one right so for instance let's check go apply this one right and press okay and i am going to go in the font test font okay we see right here we have created only three characters so we have to write ba oh sorry for that ba ba and ba and ba is working right ba is working but what i have right seen you see seen is not working because we have not created a table so we have to define the table and then every character will work right so ba and we ta you see ta is working and sa is working perfectly right so this way you have to create a table so i have done right here and i show you go to font and open type designer table so i have created the all tables right so initial forms medial forms and terminal forms okay and add one more character from here okay so this is the table of basic arabic script table this one has more features right we still have to add a ligature 